Introducing the horses, race number eight. This evening's eighth race is the first elimination of the Director of Agriculture Pace, three-year-old Colts and Gildings. Eighth race, a purse of $14,312. And the first three official finishers will return for the 13th race final. Here's the lineup. The first is a son of Tonner's big guy, owned by Kevin Reed of Newark and Jeff Reed of Granville. Dean Collins, the uh, trainer, with a market one fifty six and one here on to Cider Downs, earnings of forty thousand three hundred dollars. Don Irvine Jr. driving our general. Lantu is a dare you to call with the Giacomo Stables of Flushing, New York. Dave Myrick, the uh, trainer, with a three-year mark of 54-4, and four, earnings of $15,000. Coming off that record win, it's Bido Sports for Jeff Out. Number three, son of Towner's big guy, owned by Jerry Summers of Ohio, John Catron of Illinois, and Susan Northless of Florida, Mike Metters trains. Three-year-old Marco 155, his last start here at Decida Downs. Earnings of $27,000. Brad Henner is behind. Come on, big guy. From post four, a son of Nobleland, Sam. Owned by Richard Smith of North Royalton and uh, James Kubiak of Parma, Ohio. William Irvine is the trainer. Three-year-old record of 153-2 and two at Pocono Downs in Pennsylvania. $30,000 in earnings. William Irvine driving Nobleland Court. The five is a son of Noble and Sam, over the Peter Pan Stables of Pepper Pike, Ohio, Ivan Sugg trains, with a mark of 153 and 2 at Hoosier Park, Indiana, $76,000 in earnings. Sharp Sam, tonight driven by Randy Tharps. Tharps. From post six, a son of Towner's big guy, owned by Jack Shear of North Lawrence and Ron Postia, North Canton, Ohio, Jeff Cox, the trainer. Here, ladies and gentlemen, is a... Uh, Three-year-old with a mark of 152 and three. Earnings of over $186,000. Chris Sabra with Dave Miller. And number seven, a son of Falcon Elmerhurst, owned by John Morris of Pickwell, Ohio, and Robert Morris of Delaware. Dan Perdue, the uh, trainer, with a mark of 153 and four at Hoosier Park, Indiana. Earnings of $130,000. As a tiger with... Eric Lundford. There's your field now for the eighth race. First elimination. Win play show perfected trifecta wagering. Five minutes until post time. Five minutes. Field of seven, three year old Colts and Gildings lining up behind the gates for the first elimination of the director of agriculture pace. They're on the back stretch, and there they go. And uh, the ball up and from the far outside, eyes a tiger firing hard for the lead. Sharp Sam from the center of the track, crisp Sombra on the outside, came away third. Bit of sports is fourth from off the rail fifth. It's our general at the rail and racing is sixth as they round the first turn. Come on, big guy. The early trailer seventh is Noble Land Court. Crisp Sabra has made the front here as I as a Tiger yields for cover. Second, Sharp Sam settles in third. Opening quarter, 26 and 3. They're in straight formation as they come past us for the first time. And it's Crisp Sabra leading the way here by two. I as a Tiger to the inside. Sharp Sam is next. Then comes our general fourth. Two lengths, fifth to Bido Sports. And from off the back end, here comes Noble and Court as Irvine sends them on the way. To the outside, come on, big guy will take that cover seventh as they approach the half. But it's Crisp Sabra in control here. He leads by two, the half in 56 and four. At the rail and racing a second is as a Tiger and Sharp Sam enjoying the trip on the inside is gapping slightly third. Noble and Court failing to flush cover here is now first up and fourth. At the rail and fifth is our general. Come on, big guy drafting with live cover to the outside and Bido Sports now the trailer joins the outer flow seventh. Pace brisk. 
picks up here as they reach the uh, three quarter mile marker and it's Chris Sabra still the leader 125 and two to the three quarters and Chris Sabra by two on the inside eyes a tiger has yet to show pace on the outside and third noble and court come on big guys swinging three wide a fourth and at the rail is sharp Sam turning for home now last center an eighth of a mile ago and it's Chris Sabra on the inside eyes a tiger and it's a mad dash for cash here Chris Sabra eyes a tiger the inside but Chris Saba responding gamely. Eyes a Tiger second. Noble and Court up for third in one. 53 and two. The eighth race is now official. And here is the winner, the first elimination of the Director of Agriculture Pace, 96. Number six, Crisp Sabra, a gilding side by Tanner's big guy from the Falcon Elmahurst Mare, Cool Sabra. Owned by Marvin Gross of the Sabra Farms in Ohio. Owned by Jack Shearer, North Lawrence, Ron Posty of North Kent, in Ohio. Jeff Cox is the trainer, David Miller in the Sonke. Recording his seventh of the season in eight starts. The mile and one, 53 and two. For driver Dave Miller, that's three wins tonight, a driving triple on this evening's card. The 6-7 Perfecta paying $8.20, $8.20. The 6-7-4 Trifecta, $19.20.